what's up guys it's Jonathan with one big impact so Denise just actually asked a question her question was hey have any of you guys experienced when you go on this type of way eating meaning keto or Atkins or uh, intermittent fasting or anything like that have you guys experienced any type of issues as far as hair loss is concerned well it's actually a pretty common thing and it's pretty common for a few reasons a lot of people are under the impression that they can just eat poorly but eat keto because that's actually possible or eat poorly but eat Atkins and the reason that people get into this uh, false mistake is because they will just eat you know meats and cheeses and just kind of they'll do like if it fits your macros and they'll adapt that to Atkins or keto well why that's bad is that you first of all are not getting your calcium magnesium uh, potassium you're not getting B vitamins you're not getting nutrients that you would from like seven to ten cups of vegetables a day if you're not eating enough protein proteins gonna be able to uh, assist as far as keeping your hair keeping your balance your hormones fats all of those things so you actually need to most of all focus on a good positive well-rounded diet as far as your vegetables your healthy fats your proteins and the most important thing is a lot of times when people are doing intermittent fasting or they're doing Atkins or something like that they start to get fat adapted and they say you know what I'm just not hungry anymore so they start not eating and they're like why am I losing my hair uh, it's because you're actually malnourished you're not eating you really need to make sure that you're eating the proper amount of food no matter how you feel if you feel hungry if you don't feel hungry if you're active if you're not active you actually still need to be hitting your caloric needs if your caloric needs are twelve hundred dollars or twelve hundred dollars <laughs> twelve hundred or fifteen hundred calories that you need in a day you really need to focus on getting that each and every single day because you should not be dropping lower than whatever your weight loss calories would be so if you're required to have like 1500 2000 calories a day you need to be making that mark and especially if you're doing intermittent fasting you need to really focus on hitting that mark because if you don't for too long and this won't happen to everybody but if you don't for too long your body's going to start rejecting what you're doing because you're not getting the minerals you're not getting the micronutrients you're not getting everything that you need most people that are watching this are probably like you know what I've been eating meat and cheese and that's about it and I haven't really been eating anything else you need to be taking like a daily vitamin and getting all of those basic things make sure you're drinking water staying hydrated all those things i hope this video helped you guys if it did please like share comment and subscribe to our channel go check us out on facebook our group is called healthy living for a healthy life have a beautiful day be stronger than your excuses like the shirt says i'm in between classes have a beautiful day guys thanks a lot remember to spread love not hate peace